Welcome back to the show floor here at International Convex 2017, where I am joined by Sally, Sally Lopez, who's here to tell me a bit more about Hard Rock Hotels. Now, Sally, I'm very familiar with Hard Rock Cafes as a brand. In fact, I spent my 40th birthday in a Hard Rock Cafe in Barcelona right. with some of these guys who are holding the camera right now. Yeah. But the Hard Rock Hotels are quite a different proposition. Tell me why. Absolutely. I mean, we're all part of one family, but the hotels are actually a five-star lifestyle brand. But our key uniting thread is actually music, is our main key differentiator as a brand. And uh, we're now growing as a company. So currently we have 25 hotels in 25 cities in 11 countries. And we these are actually proper five-star hotels that actually have their own built-in conference centers inside them as well. So we cater for your business meetings, leisure meetings, you know, from your incentives, up to even big incentives and Congress um, bookings for up to uh, 4,000 4, people in our hotel in Punta Cana. Tell me whereabouts, you mentioned a hotel in Punta Cana. Where is Punta Cana? I don't it's even know. It's in Dominican Republic. Okay, um, how about uh, hotels throughout the rest of the world? Whereabouts can we stay at a Hard Rock Hotel? Right, our latest offering is actually our hotel in Tenerife. And uh, we've just opened uh, um, the hotel in December. It can cater for 700 people. And then the biggest news that we want to share with you is that we are opening our first hotel in China this year, in the summer of 2017. And the other big news is, of course, we will be in London. So I think that's, we're singing and dancing for our London property. So everybody knows the Cumberland, but the Cumberland will be converted into a hard rock hotel in summer of 2018. And there is an artist's impression of it just over your shoulder, just there. Looks fantastic. So what can event organizers expect from holding their event at a hard rock hotel in comparison to some of the other hotels that also offer conference facilities? What is your USP, would you say? Well, our unique proposition is really the music. Everything that we do, the guest engagement revolves around music. Inside our hotel, we actually have a vibe manager, and the vibe manager is the one organizing the different music and entertainment that we actually have in each corner of the hotel. And what we do as well, we, we organize special welcome for our group check-in into the hotel, and all linked to music, you know, because this is uh, the very DNA of the company. But if the music is the heart of what we do, uh, philanthropy is actually the soul of the company. So it's not just about fun and games, you know, within Hard Rock, we do serious business and we give back to the community as well. Last year, we actually built our Hard Rock Hills Foundation and through the power of music last year, we raised around $750,000 after the shooting in Orlando through a charity concert with Imagine Dragons and we donated that to the families of the victims and not a single contract was signed. Everybody just wanted to do it in collaboration with Hard Rock because we know and they know that when Hard Rock calls, you know, there is that, that, that certain prestige and collaboration that we actually get from our partners. That's the joy of the international language yeah. of music. Exactly. Has no barriers. Well, this is it. This is the very reason why we use music, you know, because as you rightly said, it transcends all boundaries. Everybody connects to it. And if, you're, if I'm going to ask every single person that is in this show or any person in the planet who doesn't like music, I don't think we'll find one so this is why I always say you know if you're sick and tired of your vanilla of your predictable experiences and you are a fan of music you'll feel right at home in a hard rock hotel listen Sally I wish you all the very best of luck with your hotels opening in Asia in China and also uh, in Europe as well good Lovely. luck for next year thank you, thank you very much thank you so much thank you so much thank you